everyone. Hope everyone's having a good day. Mike here, back down in the RC corner doing an unboxing. I got a action camera, state the obvious, Captain Obvious here. 4K Wi-Fi action camera. This is called the Eken, E-K-E-N, the Eken H9. Uh, this is a throw on the budget action camera. And the reason why I bought this research this is because I want to move to 1080p, 60 frames per second. Uh, we'll get into all the things that this can do, but um, I'll just go over quick here. It's kind of like the same form factor as a GoPro, so it's got the waterproof stuff, all the the mounts, all the other things like that. It's got a charger inside, quick clip inside the box, so that's what she looks like. So 1080p H.264 waterproof, 4K at 10 frames per second. Um, 30 frames per second, 60k frames per second, 1080p, um, up to 120 frames per second, 720p, so that'd be cool for uh, super slow motion and high detail, so I'm going to take this out of the box, so I'll show you guys what all comes inside, so uh, sit tight and we'll be right back. So I got all the contents here unpacked, and uh, beg your pardon, I don't have the manual here, even though it did come with the manual, I uh, don't have the manual present with me. I have it at another location I was reading up about how to uh, charge this thing and make everything work. But anyways, um, the manual's nice, but let's get some of the other stuff out of the way. So we have like a uh, a, a leash kind of thing for it and some double-sided tape. <coughs> <coughs> Beg your pardon. Um, and you get some tie wraps, a screen cleaner. You get some cables with Velcro straps. So you get a whole uh, bunch of stuff like that. Uh, you get a mounting clip with a gator clip. You get uh, two of these mounting clips with 3M tape on the back side. You have the uh, bike clip. <clears throat> and you got various parts and other tighteners and clips. And I'm sure all the experienced um, action camera guys know about. This is one I'll be using a lot. This one you can connect to the tripod. And it's got screws on both sides. I believe so that'll be interesting and uh, that'll be good for mounting because that's the way I plan to use it mostly um, you have your charger here with the USB cable has that uh, Samsung or Blackberry thin um, micro USB type port to connect connect this way charge <coughs> another clip here <coughs> uh, the camera itself and the interesting it comes with another back flap in case this one ever busts yeah, you have a spare one so that, that's pretty handy to know that you have that so you just clip her on down lift it up here and pop it open out of the waterproof case camera comes out you can get it in a variety of different colors I chose blue I think it looks kind of sharp and uh, you have your standard buttons there's record button there the power button on the front um, some selector buttons here. You get the two inch screen. Let's we'll see if we can power this guy on. So you got some uh, cool LEDs. I don't have a memory card in it yet, but that's what the, it looks like on the back. Also, you download the app for your iPhone or Android or even tablet, and uh, you can control this thing via Wi Fi and interact with it that way too. And of course here it has a, uh, a mini HDMI out port and the micro HDMI port. You have the micro SD slot for the card and then of course the USB cable plugs in there. And uh, you can charge it there via the cable. And also if you want to get spare batteries, you just pop here and the battery comes right out, pull them on, and you can get spare batteries for this if you wanna charge up multiple batteries for a long shooting session. So that's the Eakin camera. Like this thing's like on Banggood for like $55. I caught it on an email sale. I think I paid $45 US free shipping to my house. Like all the stuff you get, it's, I think the value is tremendous. I researched this a bit on YouTube and is it a GoPro? No, it's not. Is it going to be a great 4K camera? No, it's not. It's not why I bought it for this price point. I wanted the 
80p 60 frames per second and possibly the 720p 120 frames per second and I'll be uh, using this to shoot some videos with and uh, I will take this and show you guys how this works and what it does and what the quality is like in the future videos but this is just the unboxing so I'll have links in the notes in case you're interested in picking up a cool little action camera maybe on a budget and uh, I think the quality of the, the 1080p 60 frames per second is really good for uh, what you pay for so that's just my two cents on it and why I bought it thanks for tuning in I'd like to hear your thoughts if maybe if you have this and uh, have the experience I'd really like to know what you think about this camera also alright guys I'm gonna end it right here take care and we'll catch you on the next one peace out